Guys, welcome back to Mass Effect 2. Um, so not much left to do now. Uh, everybody is loyal, everybody is fun. Uh, we've done all the missions that we kind of need to do, so we're just going to basically spend our time talking to literally everybody on the ship, and that's it. So, start on that. Commander, sorry about the crew, and I... You know what? I'm not sorry. What the hell were you doing leaving us out here where collectors can work us over? Because you know what? I should... I should just go. Next port, just get the hell out of here. You don't mean that, Jeff. I... No, but it... It felt good. I'm sorry, Commander. Okay, I'm ready. I'm good. I'm ready to save the day. Damn right you're sorry. Maybe we should dump you. We've got an AI. What do we need a human pilot for? My capabilities are expansive, Shepard. But the human interface is critical. I have observed that effective tactics are not always predictable. If I didn't know better, I'd say you were self-limiting to protect him. That would be counterproductive. My survival is at stake as well. She's not perfect, Commander. It looks like she needs me. We got it under control. I noticed you're calling Edie her and she now. Huh. No, I hadn't really noticed that. Edie, should I have noticed that? No, Jeff. It is not worth noting. Well, there you go, Shepard. Looks like we haven't noticed anything. I think you're taking the human-machine interface a little far. I'm just having a little fun with you, Commander. No need to get all unnatural on me. What Jeff and I are exhibiting is more a platonic symbiosis than hormonally induced courtship behavior. Okay, yeah, that was a little creepy. Edie has replaced the whole crew. You're not concerned she can replace you two? Well, she's amazing, but there's something off about how she handles the Normandy. We ran simulations, and it's better when we both have the helm. Calculating an optimum course of action is simple. If two AI weapons are pitted against each other, the one with superior hardware will always win. Human misjudgments defy predictive models. License to screw up, Commander. You heard it straight from the ship. I need everyone at their best. We get no second chance, so no more losing it. Understand? Understood, Commander. Edie and I have it under control. Commander. Yeah, I think, I think we're good. Now. See you, Commander. That's fucking great. I love Joker. Joker is probably the best character in every game. Fuck Ashley, fuck Caden. I want to leave them both on Vermeer. Actually, Rex is pretty good too. Fuck. It's a tough choice. Why can't I bring Joker on these missions? That's the real question. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Perhaps later. Trying to determine how scale itch got onto Normandy. Sexually transmitted disease only carried by Varen. Implications unpleasant. Anything else? I guess that's it. I'll let you work. Actually, what does squad to say? Let me see. Shepard, how can I help? Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Oh, there's some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. The Cerberus personnel are excellent. They're not on the ship anymore. They're potentially dead. Commander, can I help you with something? I'm more interested in just talking for a bit. I'm good, Shepard. Ready for anything. We live, we'll get loud. Spill some drinks on the Citadel. The opinion of the crew. What do you think of the state of the crew? This crew is as good as it can be. We've got a shot. A long shot. But it's a hell of a lot better than nothing. Anything else, Commander? We'll talk later. Commander. I'm going to assume that's an, that's an undersight. Because when you're referring to crew, you're referring to the people who left. The people who you've been gathering this entire time, that's the team. Different. Alright, uh, Captain's Cabin, uh... I don't know, is there anything up there? No crew members up here, though. Rip. Now, Space Hamster, what do you think about the situation? Well, at least the collectors didn't take that. Thank goodness for that. Oh. It's that ball I got. It just pulses. Clean out dead fish, the fuck? I don't have any dead fish there, or maybe I do. Uh, I guess I had dead fish in there. Whatever, stop judging me, guys. Alright, crew quarters. I said, we'll make a pass by everyone, see what they have to say about the situation. Kitsubi, what do you think about the crew? So quiet around here. I miss the crew. One of the first people to actually talk about the crew. My heart goes out to Miranda and her sister. That's a rough situation. Jacob deserves better than a father like that. I probably would have wanted to shoot him, too. I can see why Jack is the way she is. I don't like it, but I get it. Come back later. I'm 
sure I'll have more to talk about. Uh, it's just a one-way conversation, you know? It's very awkward. Do you need something? Have a few minutes to talk. Later. I'd like to consider what we've already discussed. You mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all. I should go. I shall return to my meditations. Alright, well, it looks like we're getting less and less people to, to talk to now. Alright, obviously people here are gone. Shepard. How are you? Perhaps we could speak later. I wish to meditate. I should go. Of course. Yeah, it's looking like <laughs> we've done, we've exhausted every single discussion. Uh, I mean, we already know that we've talked with the, the shit out of Miranda. And either Tally or Miranda is going to want to bang me. I don't know, man. I'm both fucking disgusting. No. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. What do you think about the Cerberus crew? Have the Cerberus crewmen giving you any trouble? <laughs> I think being part of the team that took down Saren got me some points. Everyone I talked to was polite anyway. Don't worry, Commander. We're all working together. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Garrus really didn't have that much dialogue for this game. I, I only did talk to him like two or three times and that was it. We didn't really, we didn't really save that much to each other. Alright, well... Nothing over there. Wonder if Legion has something to follow up on. Shepherd Commander. I'd like to find out more about you. Topic. When we took you aboard, I noticed you have a piece of N7 armor welded to you. Where did you get it? It was yours. When you disappeared, we were sent to find you. We began where you first encountered the heretics. Eden Prime. After the old machine's attack, it was heavily defended. We were discovered. This is the impact of a rifle shot. How many other Geth were sent out to find me? We are the only mobile platform beyond the Veil. Organics fear us. We wish to understand, not in sight. One platform was judged sufficient. You've been looking for me for two years? We visited Therum, Pharos, Novaria, Vermeer, Ilos. A dozen unsettled worlds. The trail ended at Normandy's wreckage. You were not there. Organic transmissions claimed your death. We recovered this debris from your hard suit. The Geth are listening in on our transmissions? Organic life reacts to stimuli in unpredictable ways. We wish to learn. What do you mean by stimuli? We placed a fabricated story on the extranet that a certain arrangement of stars viewed from the Batarian homeworld formed the face of a Salarian goddess. Without waiting for verification, some declared a proof of the goddess's existence. Those who noted the lack of proof were attacked. The arguments taught us much. The experiment ended when a Salarian cult tried to purchase colonization rights to the stars and found they did not exist. It sounds like you're running experiments on us. You are sapient life, but not like us. If we can model organic behavior, we can comprehend the Quarian creators. We do not understand their judgments in the Morning War. What's the Morning War? The conflict between the Geth and the Quarian creators. The war fought at the dawn of our intelligence. It concluded with the departure of the Creator Migrant Fleet. Why were you trying to contact me? You opposed the heretics, those that took the old machines as gods. All kinds of organics fought Sovereign and his Geth allies. Why am I so interesting? You were the most successful. You killed their god. You succeeded where others did not. Your code is superior. That doesn't explain why you use my armor to fix yourself. There was a hole. But why didn't you fix it sooner? Or with something else? No data available. Aww. Shepard Commander. Me and Legion are bros. More about you. We are building a consensus. Please try and get uh, we, questions. We've done this already. I have to get back. Acknowledged. No data available, guys. Uh, well, we can't. What's this can't, area? We can't look at uh, Shockwell's computer. Logging you out, Shepard. Very sad story. All right, let's go to engineering. By the way, I want to say something about the heretics. Um, 
So, you could have destroyed them all easily. For some reason, my little guide of best ending told me not to do that. And there is sort of a reason that isn't necessary in Mass Effect uh, 3. Um, so I'll just keep it as it is. I don't care. It, it, it doesn't make that much of a big difference, so it's okay. Shepard. Just checking in. How you doing? Battlemaster. I have yeah. Shepard. Shepard. Jack, what do you think about the situation of uh, all the uh, uh, all the server staff being potentially dead or gone? Hey, what's happening? Shepard, we talked enough. <laughs> You're just pissing around. I should go. Whatever. I'm just pissing around. So yeah, if you open up to her and she goes cries on your shoulder and then has IRL sex or whatever the fuck. I mean, all, all the all the banging in this game is with clothes on. It's really weird. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? Yes, I'd like that. I've been thinking about the last time we talked, and I do trust you. I hope you know that. This means something to me. It means a lot, but I don't want... To share you. Oh, fucking hell. You don't need to share me. I'm not interested in anybody except you, Tally. Oh. Well, then I'll talk to you later, once you've made that clear to Miranda. <laughs> oh, fuck, dude. They found me out. Uh, do we want to fuck? <clears throat> it's literally like fucking Darth Helmet or whatever the fuck from Spaceballs. It's, it's who we're trying to. Be. I don't know. Nah, we'll just we'll just fuck Miranda. It's okay. Fuck, fuck Tally. Tally's a piece of shit, dude. Uh, honestly, I uh, actually let's talk to Zade. Honestly, I hate Quarians to be honest because everything they did, they deserve. They were like shit to the geth, you know. Fucking dickheads. I mean, Tally's alright, but seriously. Back for more. Joker handled himself well. Should have come back here and got a real weapon. Still, did real well for a kid with glass palms. Pretty sure I'd be laid up in bed if I were him. Jack, Subject Zero, whatever you call her. Hell of a girl. Could have used a destructive little bitch like that ten years ago when we dropped blind into the Krogan DMZ. Took out a lot of Krogan that day, but we lost way too many men. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. Alright, well, I think we've done everything, so... Let's, uh, let's go then. Because, dude, that's not, that, like, when, the way I said that shit to fucking, um, Tally, that was not Renegade Shep right there. Oh, I'm always exclusive to you, Tally. Oh. He's got, like, the fucking, like... Like, weird face with like the fucking implants and shit. Oh, Tally, I love you. God damn. I, ca I cannot, I cannot play this game. At all. Alright, launch suicide mission. Also, if we wait, then the crew dies, so we gotta go, so. Let, let us go. Omega-4. If we literally do anything else, it, they will die, so... Yeah. Let's go. Please confirm destination, Shepard. The Reaper IFF is online, but there is a chance that the Normandy may not survive the Omega-4 relay. Once we are en route, we are committed. The Collectors are about to find out what happens when you piss me off. You got it, Commander. Plotting a course for the Omega-4 Relay. ETA about two hours. I'll let you know when we arrive. Two hours? What are we gonna do on the bed? Oh. Pardon me, Commander. Oh, Christ. I've cleared the engine room. I'll be there in five minutes. I mean, I, 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 <laughs> that's what I should do. Uh, fine. 
Let's do some calibrations. I should have known you wouldn't settle for the captain's quarters. I settle for nothing but the best. But you changed your clothes? Oh, yeah, of course, for the cuts there. Shepard, I wish I had more information for you. I don't like you heading through that relay blind, but we don't have much choice. You know me. I like the challenge. This is as good as it gets. That's why I brought you back. Always willing to take on the impossible. Despite the danger, it's a great opportunity. The first human to take a ship through and survive. I've got room on the Normandy if you're that eager to see it. It's a tempting offer, but it's not my place. I just wanted you to know I appreciate the risk you're taking. Regardless of your opinion of Cerberus, of me, you are a valuable asset to all of humanity. Be careful, Shepard. So we're gonna guess they got into deep shit for showing skin in Mass Effect 1, because that was fucking lame. Also, Omega-4 Relay. Approaching Omega-4 Relay. Everyone stand by. Let's make it happen. Reaper IFF activated. Signal acknowledged. Commander, drive core just lit up like a Christmas tree. Drive core electrical charge at critical levels. Rerouting. Brace for deceleration. Too close. These must be all the ships that tried to make it through the Omega-4 relay. Some look ancient. I have detected an energy signature near the edge of the accretion disk. Has to be the collector base. Take us in for a closer look. Nice and easy. Engineering deck. 
in the cargo hold. I'll take a team and deal with the intruder. You get the rest of them off our tail. Aye, aye, Commander. Oh, should I get to choose whoever I want? Also, let's cycle appearance inside these guys. The fuck? We turn them into, like, something else. Who else do we do? Yeah, we did hers. Uh, let's bring around the typical... These two. I like these two. Oh, we got three points, and I'm gonna really put it into. Alright. Uh, fucking three points here. Or oh, piercing ammo, sure. And fortification, yeah. Alright. Oculus. Fuck, that thing's huge. Alright, oh, of course. What the hell? She's got armor. Did, did something just disappear from my own eyes? Oh, we can just do this. So the fact he's getting closer. up to Shepard. Oh, Jesus. I mean, I do have that. Is, that. is this really the time for this? I don't think this is the time for it, to be honest. Don't worry, guys. Nobody else is, uh... This thing's target anyways. I mean, we do have power cells here. No, 100 credits? At the end of the game? Don't mind if I do. Honestly, it's more I'm curious to know how much I can get away with not actually using any of that. Oh, look, look, they're Krogan dead. I think he just face through that. Okay. That might be a bit of a problem. <laughs> he actually went on top of me. SMG son. Dead for sure this time. Better get back up here, Commander. We're about to clear the debris field. There it is. The collector base. See if you can find a place to land without drawing attention. Too late. Looks like they're sending out an old friend to greet us.
our new team. Fire the main gun. How do you like that, you sons of bitches? Get in close and finish him off. Everybody hold on, gonna be a wild ride! <laughs> systems overloaded during the crash. Restoring operation will take time. We all knew this was likely a one-way trip. I'll do whatever it takes to stop the collectors, but I plan to live to tell about it. I'm glad you're in charge. What's next? How long until the collectors find this landing zone? I do not detect an internal security network. It is possible the collectors do not expect anyone to reach the base. Well, if we're lucky. Their external sensors were hit like we were. They might not know we're alive. This isn't how we planned this mission, but this is where we're at. We can't worry about whether the Normandy can get us home. We came to stop the Collectors, and that means coming up with a plan to take out this station. Edie, bring up your scans. You should be able to overload their critical systems if you get to the main control center here. That means going through the heart of the station, right past this massive energy signature. That's the central chamber. If our crew, or any of the colonists, are still alive, the Collectors are probably holding them in there. Looks like there are two main routes. Might be a good idea to split up to keep the Collectors off balance, then regroup in the central chamber. No good. Both routes are blocked. See these doors? The only way past is to get someone to open them from the other side. A few well-placed explosives should clear a path. There is insufficient ordnance on board to create an explosion capable of damaging the interior walls. If we can't blast our way through, then we'll use stealth. Someone could sneak in through this ventilation shaft here. Practically a suicide mission. I volunteer. I appreciate the thought, Jacob, but you couldn't shut down the security systems in time. We need to send a tech expert. It's your call, Commander. Who do we send into the shaft? All right, so <clears throat> the way... the. The way most of these choices work, I looked it up. So actually, the first time I actually played this game, I got it all right. Nobody died. Um, so the way my thinking w uh, of it last time was just logically, you send in people who are obviously uh, that kind of have tech abilities or work in kind of tech kind of stuff. So I think that's just Talia and Legion. Uh, the rest of these fuckers will die. And they also have to be loyal, obviously. We can just send in. We'll send in Legion. Legion, you can hack through anything. I'm sending you into the shaft. Acknowledged. The rest of us will break into two teams and fight down each passage. That should draw the Collector's attention away from what you're doing. I'll lead the second fire team, Shepard. We'll meet up with you on the other side of the doors. Not so fast, cheerleader. Nobody wants to take orders from you. This isn't a popularity contest. Lives are at stake. Shepard, you need someone who can command loyalty through experience. All right, so this next one, uh, I'm not too sure. It's it's always the people that are like, I guess. Uh, I, I honestly, I don't, honestly know, don't know what you're supposed to pick for a leader. Um, I think I picked Miranda last time, uh, but apparently Garrus and Jacob should also work. 
Uh, but we're taking Garrus with us, so and Jacob sucks, so we can we can actually just just do this because it tells you a bunch of shit. Like like no like she's a uh, like she's volatile. She's not a very good leader, you know. She's whatever. Uh, yeah, f like fuck these guys. Like yeah, and she also has like an ability that kind of makes her into a leader. So I'm, I'm not too sure about this one, but like yeah, I, I well I know that this is gonna result in probably success, but. I'm just saying, like, from a perspective of, like, what are you supposed to pick here? Um, yeah, because, like, you, you, you think about good leaders and you don't think of, like, Grunt or whatever. Because Grunt's, like, uh, just wants to kill shit, so, yeah. Miranda's right. She should be in charge. I won't let you down, Shepard. Once we're in, they're gonna throw everything they have at us. If we're weak, if we're slow, if we hesitate, we'll die. The Collectors attacked our ship. They took our crew, our friends. They think we're helpless. They're wrong. They started a war, but we're not here to finish it. We're here to make them regret. To show them and everyone else what happens when you go too far. No more running, and no more waiting. Let's hit them where they live. All right, so we're not allowed to take the the fire team and specialists, so we uh, bring our two friends over, and that's it. And uh, that's it. the hell? I was like, in a very odd pose. We are in position. Exterior temperature slightly elevated. No obstructions detected. Second team, are you in position? In position. Meet you on the other side of those doors. Alright, time to go wreck some collectors. <laughs> 